How's it going, Mike? What's up, buddy? How are you? Good, good feeling you. good. I'm so excited to be here. Um, everybody, you of course know Mike Cameron from the show, and here we are at another one of your amazing listings. And this one is incredible. Yeah, G give us the overview. Well, you can see out here, this home was built with the charm and beauty in mind of Tuscany, from the old world pavers outside, to the clay tile roof, to the stone hearth outside. This is a 5,000 square foot main home with a 1,200 square foot guest house. And there's also an 1,100 square foot uh, workspace. It's a garage, it's, it could be a two car garage, but they're using it now as a workspace. It's got countertop sinks, and it's sometimes used when the vineyards, you know, they'll, they'll crush the grapes in there and use it for that too. Come on in. Wow, and home sweet home. Home sweet home it is. Yes, this is a, a, a special, special home. Uh, you'll see this is the main lounge area for the living area. And it's got a, this home has dual fireplaces so that when you're sitting inside or outside, you can enjoy the fireplace. There's one here, there's one in that room as well. But this is the main dining area and you'll see that sellers took detailed care of making the furniture for this home. To this end, we've got one bathroom and a workout room, an entrance to the, the uh, casita room. And then off, off to this side, we have the kitchen, another sitting area. There's a game room in there with a, you know, we, we can play pinball, we can play pool, whatever you'd like to do in there. I'm up for everything you mentioned. What do yeah. you say we head that Let's way? Let's check it out. Well, you can see this is a massive kitchen. You can, you know, seat quite a few people in here and it's very open and roomy for, you know, whether you're cooking or entertaining. You'll notice here that the lighting is really bright, right? All these can lights are all brand new halo LED lights that you can adjust to the temperature. So if wow. you're feeling a little bit moody, you can turn <laughs> it up or down yeah. and adjust it for the warmth that you prefer. Thermador appliances, we've got maple engineered wood flooring and stone tile in the kitchen. One of my favorite things is just standing here and looking out at your backyard because that pool, it feels yeah. like we're almost in the pool the way that there's, it, it, it seems like it's an infinity edge right up to the house Yeah, to the they really here. wanted to have um, the feeling of bringing in the outside indoors and you know having the indoor outdoor entertaining so they made this uh, visibility so that when there's big parties out here you felt like you're part of the party as well. Wow and a large game room at that. We got poker, we got pool, whatever your preference. Are you a pool player or you a paper? You have to take the two, which one would you do? Well, I've won at a little bit of everything in the show. So yeah. uh, I will say I win the most at pool. Okay. Um, you want to see what we can do? Let's see what you can do. How many ways can I show First one to hit a ball in wins. on the break. Bam, and that's how it's done. This uh, is the highlight of the house. One of the highlights. There are many of them. But it's one of the highlights. It's one of my favorite things. This is an actual wine room. These, uh, obviously, we've got a vineyard out here. They're wine enthusiasts. So at the end of the day, you enjoy a, 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 a nice wine room here that's split cooled. Wow. There's 2,000 bottles. Or oh my gosh. Yeah. Okay, let's take you into the master, real special suite here. Uh, that you'll notice the attention to the shutters, the woods, you feel the warmth in the woods. This is a room that overlooks the entire vineyard and real special room. Very nice, and as you say that, I gotta walk to the windows to yeah. see that. That is an amazing vineyard. But not only do you have that, but you're surrounded by all these mountains as well. That's right, you can overlook not only the pool and the fire features, there's different colors that come out of the pool, you'll see that later. But um, what's really cool out there too is that when they have a movie going, you can hear the audio from the movie throughout the entire property. Wow. Not just out there, but there's speakers all around the property. This house is hardwired for Dolby Sounds. So very spacious in here. Check out the tile. 
I mean, that's a pretty cool shower. That's a pretty amazing shower. I count one, two, three shower heads. You got the rain heads. Yeah. I mean, Beautiful this is a style. shower you're just gonna spend a lot of time in. That's right. The great outdoors. This is the most incredible entertaining space I've seen in a long time in San Diego. As you can see, you know, you've got the double doors bringing the guests outside and this wonderful covered patio area with the custom lighting all throughout, custom stone hearth. And again, you've got the uh, pavers on the bottom here. And there's something about water, I always say it, it's relaxing, it's fun. And when you live in San Diego, you're gonna spend a lot of time outside. Oh, yeah. And when you have a backyard like this, yeah. you're gonna definitely spend a lot of time outside. And during the summer, of course, uh, but at night, this is where the magic happens. Those, the fire features there, they have custom lighting in them. And throughout the entire pool, you've got custom lights so you can set the tone with any color you want. And then that's where that waterfall and grotto are. It's just amazing. Now, as we walk this way, talk about this half of the yard here. Yeah, well, again, we see entertainment and activity, right? We've got the ping pong table here, golf, got the bocce ball back there. But this is uh, a really nice two bedroom, 1200 square foot attached guest house. Right next to that, we've got an 1100 square foot. Uh, it's a two car garage, but it's currently, currently being used as a workspace. When the, when the harvest for the grapes are going, that's a good place to you know, handle some of the wine and the grapes in there. You got the fire pit here. Um, I think they just harvested these, but there's 316 vines, I believe. Uh, four different varieties of wine, and it is an active producing vineyard. So I think they got 120 bottles out of it wow. in 2019 and 2020 is about double that. And what a great spot to have you know, a wedding. There's been weddings out at this property that uh, were really special. Absolutely, I could see some epic entertainment happening here. Yeah. Of course, you have the grill down here and it's set up right now for entertaining, mm -hmm. um, but it's also set up for just peace and quiet. Now, as we walk this way, I mean, it is kind of set up like an amphitheater. It really is. And you know, the cool thing about it is the seating is designed to be facing the screen, which there's a screen behind that cabinet there. You don't see it, but it takes about 15 minutes to set it up and it comes up, it's massive. And uh, they've got the seating here, but you've also got Dolby sound. Very nice, a special home, a special yeah. opportunity. It's not quite over yet. We're gonna go jump in the helicopter and take a look at the lay of the land here in Blossom Valley. Are you ready? Let's go, let's go, let's, let's check it out. Now here we are flying over the home. Now to my right, I see one of the lakes that we're gonna visit. It's literally right there. But here's the home. Talk about the layout of the property, the land, the space, and how you're gonna be able to spread out in a home like this. Too bad. The Sellers built this in uh, 2009, and it was inspired by the beauty and charm of Tuscany. You've got a small number of custom homes in this location. The, the, there are walking paths and horse, horse trails throughout you know, the neighborhood. What makes this community so fun? Is it the ability to hop on your bike and head over to the lake? Or, or in your words, what can you do in the area? Well, outdoor and recreation. You can do all kinds of stuff from hiking, hiking to biting, boating to fishing. Um, you know, not too far. We go up the road and there's camping in Julian wow. Mountains in the Cuyamaca Mountains. So yeah. I think this is a great location because you've got that. If somebody wants to live on a ranch or wants to live on a private estate, you know, there are only a couple of places to really do that in San Diego. You've got Rancho Santa Fe to the north, some north communities, north county communities. But East County has its own special charm. 
and uh, set of benefits of being out here and uh, you know just tucked in this in this location with all the lakes around and the mountains and yeah hiking yeah and that is what makes blossom valley blossom valley is the ability to do all of those things i mean you could be atving in the morning and you could be out on the lake wakeboarding in the evening that's right a lot of the homeowners out here are very um, active they have, live an active lifestyle whether it's camping boating fishing you, know, you name it very nice. Now, we've had the uh, beauty of flying the helicopter here, um, but driving-wise, how far of a drive is it from the home to get here to Lake Jennings? Great question. Uh, we're just probably about five miles from wow. Lake Jennings, probably yeah. maybe less than that. Uh, San Diego is really just, you know, downtown San Diego is only 17, 20 minutes from here, so it's a, it's a quick drive. Yeah, and that's one of the beauties of, you know, living in this particular home and living in San Diego in general is you are so close to everything. Um, and speaking of lakes, I love that we're approaching uh, San Vicente Reservoir, Reservoir as well. Yeah. Um, what do you love about, about San Vicente? San Vicente is a small lake and it doesn't get to really overuse, you overuse capacity. I mean, they limit the number of boats that can go out there every day. But whenever you're out there, it's, it's, it's a real small feel, right? It's, uh, the channels are narrow. When you're on a boat and you're driving the boat, you're skiing behind it. You've got the mountains to each side of you, wow. so it's real unique. It's real fun. Absolutely, and as we can see those mountains and everything, you're making me want to get down there um, and try out some wakeboarding. So maybe we land this and we come back. Let's get on it. Yeah, there it. we go. <laughs> well, as always, it's a pleasure hanging out with you, you again. Too. You too. Flying Bye. with you, seeing real estate, seeing the homes you're selling. A big thank you to the homeowners, and I know I will see you again very soon. I will see you soon. Look forward to it. Thanks for having us up here. Of course. Hello everybody, I just wanna say thank you so much for watching this video. Make sure you subscribe right now, turn on the bell notifications, and of course follow us on Instagram for all the behind the scenes at SD Luxury Listings.